Howdy folks, <clears throat> it's 11.45 in the morning on Wednesday. Uh, anyways, I just wanted to show you, if you can see that, that's my drinking cup. And uh, that was water this morning and now it's ice. Uh, it's that cold in here. Uh, some of the things I've done this morning is uh, over here near the pantry, um, what I did is, this is some of the wires, for instance, that'll go up to the uh, kitchen lights, uh, you know, for those three and four-way switches. Here's uh, in the bathroom, and uh, I think I was mentioning yesterday that I had five or maybe six um, wires that go in here and I think it's six as I look at it uh, this morning I I wired that outlet here's a switch and this is the pantry I need a 20 amp there in the pantry and another 20 amp off of the same circuit so because up there I've got uh, a rafter that goes right over this wall. I had to find another way to feed this wire from here over to here. Now that's about a five foot distance, but I probably had to run 15 feet of wire. What I have to do is go up from this switch, catch this side, go up that way and use one of the holes up there. You can see my yellow wire. Come across the top, and I've got all this loop that I've got to take care of. Drill through those three two-by-fours. Come on down. Here's a inside wall. Go through here, back into there, and then come across these four studs. Um, and then down into the outlet. Now, I've had a little bit of fiddling around this morning, having to run back to the house, um, back and forth, because of the one car is in the garage. But, uh, oh, and, uh, but anyways, that's about it. And then I wired that light up there. So there's, it just, when you sit and reflect on it, I mean, I look at it and I think, well, I got, it's almost noon and I got four receptacles wired. I don't even have those two done that I was just describing with the yellow 20 amp wire. <coughs> so, um, you know, it's slow, it's cold. Um, like I said in my blog, the heater does not work. It's so freaking cold in here. So what I do is I warm my hands by the halogen light and they get cold about every minute and a half or so and I have to go warm them up. Uh, it's supposed to be 40 degrees today. I don't believe that it'll get anywhere near that. Um, anyways, doesn't matter what the weather is. I have to keep trudging along. Uh, we put in for 11 smoke detectors, I believe. Uh, here's a light. But you see, here's a smoke detector box. You see it says SM, and that stands for smoke detector. And so what we had to have is a smoke detector outside of a bedroom and inside of a bedroom. And this is the master bedroom. Uh, so we had to do that. Uh, in each of the uh, um, bedroom areas. I did it in the hall. I put one over there. And then this is our feature area. And there's one up there. And in fact, I'll bet you, you can see the SM. Uh, well, you can see it right there. Uh, and then I have one over here. 
as well as one downstairs. So uh, they'll all hook up to the electricity and then there'll be uh, battery operated back up on them. Um, but, you know, not only is it the law, I overdid it as far as where I placed them, but I, you know, just want to be sure that we're doing everything that we should to be safe. So, um, anyways, I think that's about it. Thanks for watching.